that, now that thing is open. Good morning, this is Jeff with SewerTech Northwest. Today we're at property address 3580 Southeast El Camino Drive here in Gresham. We're located inside the basement bathroom by the furnace. We've got a 3-inch ABS clean-out hooked to a 4-inch cast iron line. That's what we're in now. We're going to check the overall condition and serviceability of the sanitary sewer line. And we're currently sitting right at the base of the, the sewer stack where the line levels out and starts to head out of the house. Here we go.
All right, this spot right here at 83 feet is likely going to stop the camera. We'll see if this flush gets around the corner or not. Yeah, and that's it right there. I can't go any farther or risk breaking my camera at this point. I'm going to go locate and see where we're at here exactly. Okay, I just located the camera head here. We are right in the middle of the sidewalk. So the distance from this point to the main lateral is probably about 12 to 15 feet, as long as it doesn't do a whole bunch of crazy turns in between that point. Uh, but we're, we're very close to the street edge here. I've had many circumstances in the past. You'd, you'd have to check with the city. I think they take it more case by case out here, but uh, I've had a few circumstances where the city actually accepts responsibility from the right of way out, which is which where we're at, is right where we're at at this point. You know, I've got to have water running the whole time during this. There's, it's an extremely difficult line to scope, uh, but so far I haven't seen any signs of standing water whatsoever. I'll stop if we see any of those. to locate where I thought there was a clean out right around 30 feet. Um, if it is a clean out, it's been covered up by concrete. Now what I would recommend though, if it's even possible, the, the tricky part with this clean out here is it's also been converted into a, a, a drain line for the kitchen sink. It's an extremely awkward clean out. Uh, if you tried to run anything else through here other than a camera, you'd have an extremely hard time even doing it to begin with. So. If you could convert this clean out here, change the configuration so it's an actual T or, or even better, a Y fitting would allow you to actually get stuff down the line here in an easy fashion, which is kind of what you want when you're trying to try and clean the sewer line. and I was talking about there about 20 feet. It, it may actually just be a drain tying into further into the line. At this point we're coming back underneath the basement floor here, getting close to pulling the camera out of the line. We have good flow and I, I could see beyond where we stopped about another two, three feet, which, which we can see all the way to the street curb at least. I can see about three, four feet at, down the line any given point. Everything to the street edge is, has great flow all the way to the street. I see no evidence or signs of any flow issues beyond that point. More than likely, it transitions to concrete at the street edge. Very common. Uh, what's uncommon is to have this much cast iron, which is great. This is a fantastic scenario. Stuff holds up for a long time. Uh, this line has not settled even at the least. Kind of amazing to see that on a house this age. Uh, there is no stand water in the line. There's no roots. There's a little bit of scale buildup, but it's not at the point where I recommend fixing it. Or I'm sorry, not fixing, but drain cleaning it out of there. So good, good flow to the street. All the pipe we scope there today. We got to 83 feet. I can really see the closer to about 86 feet. It's all in good condition out to that point, and it, we were be stopped short of reality about 10 feet roughly from the main. Now the line is functioning properly at this time, all the way out to at least 86 feet. Now it's got to be functioning beyond that because there's no standing water, there's no signs of flow trouble. You could have aged older concrete out there, but it appears to still be doing its job as everything's flowing through nicely. Now you'd, ha you'd have to reconfigure this clean out here to, to scope beyond that point. Ideally, you put one outside the house. You don't have to go through all the twists and turns inside the home here. 